Hello and welcome back, guys. This is the last from the special events uh, epic cards that we have. Uh, AC Monaco. As you can see, the players in this pack are mostly comprised of the four and yeah, mostly four star players from the rest of the uh, Uber Eats League. As you can see, the star player is Ben Yeder. And let's go. Fox in the box. Nice. Uh, I would use him as a center forward, not as a secondary striker. Uh, low pass is great on him. You don't need to touch that. Ball control during tight possession needs to go as much as dribbling and tight possession is 82. Finishing needs to be 85 for starters. Speed needs to be increased until his kicking power is close to 85. Acceleration needs to be increased to 90 until his uh, offensive awareness is 90. The rest you allocate on jumping, and that is how you build Ben Yeder. Scissor feint, double touch, Marseille turn, cheap shot control, acrobatic finishing, first time shot, one touch pass, through passing, penalty specialist, and super sub. Best trait, great addition to any Division 1 squad, unwavering form, so yeah, you can, you can use him whenever you like. Minamino, whole player, left winger, striker, secondary striker, advanced midfielder, and right, mid, uh, right flanker. Depends on what you want for him. If you want to have him more on the flanks, then you increase his ball control during that possession to 85, low pass to 75, finishing 75, and rest you allocate on speed and acceleration that is matching ex offensive awareness almost 80, and speed until his kicking power is almost 80 as well. That is when you want him to be on your flanks. If you want to have him on center forward and secondary striker for, uh, positions, you need to increase tight possession to 74, low pass needs to be 75, finishing needs to be close to 80, to, and speed and acceleration needs to be as much as high as kicking power is 80 and above, offensive awareness is 80 as well. As advanced midfielder, offensive awareness needs to go as 80, ball control during tight possession needs to be 82, low pass needs to be 82, Finishing needs to be 75, and the speed of acceleration you increase whatever you have left of the points that you can allocate. That is as, as advanced midfielder. But mostly I would use him on the flanks and center forward or secondary striker. Double touch, cut turn, long range curl, dipping shot, long range shooting, acrobatic finishing, one touch pass, through passing, outside curl, track back. Track back will deplete his stamina, so you need to in, uh, put counter target on him. Standard form, you can use him only when he is B and A. Nibble. Good starting points, but reflexes needs to be 85 and above. Goalkeeping awareness needs to be 85 and above. Catching needs to be around 85, bearing needs to be around 85, and reach needs to be around 85 and above. Kicking power, jumping, and physical contact, all of that needs to be good. But yeah, decent goalkeeper, low punt and long throw for Division 2, and backup for Division 1, but yeah, decent for Division 2. Standard form, you can use him when he is B and A. Maripan, Destroyer, Defensive awareness needs to be 85 to 90, Speed needs to be 75, Acceleration needs to be 70, Jumping needs to be around 82, and Physical Contact needs to be almost close to 90, and you will have a decent Destroyer as a center back, but well, again, he is good for Division 2 and backup for Division 1 plays. Heading, man marking, area superiority, standard form. And last, we have Mohamed Kamara, box to box midfielder. Great starting points. Defensive awareness needs to be 75. Ball control driven at point suggestion needs to be as much as dribbling is 75. Low pass needs to be around 82. Finishing needs to be close to 70 if it's possible. Say 65 is a uh, low low uh, ballpark where your finishing needs to be with him speed needs to be as much as kicking power is close to 75 to 80 acceleration needs to be as much as uh, offensive awareness is 75 and above 
physicals need to be increased also to at least 72, 73 physical contact, and that is how you develop him. Double touch, cut the one touch pass, gamemanship, interception, sliding tackle, acrobatic clearance, and fighting spirit. Decent player to have as a backup and star player for Division 2. Yeah. All around, I believe, after Barcelona, this is also the weakest pack that you can pull out from this special cards that we have. Thank you again for watching. Thank you for being a lovely audience. We're going to see each other in the next videos. And uh, like, share, subscribe. I'm live on Twitch every Monday and Wednesday at uh, 21.30 CT. So you can ask me anything there. All the links are going to be down below. Join this good community and we will see each other in the next videos.